So let us talk about uh, data mining today. This is a very important topic. Data mining is an interdisciplinary subfield of computer science. So this is the computational process of discovering patterns. This is very important. Finally, we will be talking only about patterns because actually taking out or finding out these patterns from large data sets, big data, uh, which involves a method at the intersection of artificial intelligence, say machine learning, statistics and database systems. All these things are involved. Computer science people might be knowing all this. So the overall goal of this data mining process is to find or to extract information, to discover pattern, to extract information from data set and then transform it into an understandable structure for further use. Transforming also is involved. So data mining is the analysis step of the knowledge discovery in databases the process that is KDD. And the term uh, is in itself a misnomer because the goal is the extraction of patterns and knowledge from large amount of data, not the extraction of data itself. See, the goal is the extraction of patterns and knowledge, not the extraction of data itself. We are not extracting the data. We are not mining the data. So this term is frequently applied to any form of large scale data or information processing. It may be collection, extraction, warehousing, analysis and statistics, as well as any application of computer decision support system, uh, including artificial intelligence, machine learning as business intelligence. The actual data mining task is automatic or semi-automatic analysis of large quantities of data to extract previously unknown. This is very important. Those things which are unknown, you need to extract those uh, patterns or information through some automatic or semi-automatic uh, analysis. And interesting patterns such as groups of uh, data records, which is also known as cluster analysis, then unusual records, which is anomaly detection and dependencies which is done by association rule mining. So this usually involves using database techniques such as spatial indices. So this is one of the uh, way how we extract information or mine information. So these patterns can then be seen as a kind of summary of input data and may be used in further analysis. Or for example, in machine learning or predictive, uh, predictive analytics. So the term, uh, the related term also is uh, when you will come across Data mining is data dredging, data fishing and data snooping. Uh, these refer to the use of data mining methods to sample parts of larger population data set that are too small for reliable statistical inference to be made about the validity of any patterns discovered. So these three terms you will be uh, you know, encountering when you, you are learning data mining. So these methods, uh, these methods can however be used in creating new hypothesis to test against the larger data populations. Data mining is inferring new information from already collected data. Traditionally job of data analyst it was and computer have actually changed this and far more efficient to come through data using a machine than eyeballing the statistical data. So let us formally define data mining. Data mining in data is the non-trivial process of identifying valid, novel, potentially useful and ultimately understandable patterns in data. So let us have a comparison or talk in terms of data mining also in terms of data analysis. So in terms of software and the marketing thereof, data mining is actually not equal to data analysis. Because data mining implies software uses some intelligence over simple grouping and partitioning of data to infer new information. Whereas data analysis is more in line with standard statistical software, that is web stats. So this usually present information about subsets and relation, uh, relations within the recorded data set. Whereas data mining is, you know, putting intelligence uh, into uh, to infer new information. And what is data mining? What is not data mining? 
look up or phone number in phone directory sorry not data mining query a web search engine from information about amazon or any other uh, word or company is not data mining but what is data mining certain names or modes prevalent in uh, us locations or indian locations and grouping together similar documents returned by search engine according to their context this is data mining there are various techniques of data mining few of them let me highlight classification clustering regression and association rules so why mine data this is a very important question why to mine data what is the scientific point point of view or viewpoint data collected and stored at enormous speed you know gb uh, today we have enormous amount of data say remote sensors on satellite telescope scanning the skies micro arrays generating gene expression data or say scientific simulation generating terabytes of data so these traditional techniques uh, are infeasible to uh, for this raw raw data so data mining may help us and scientists and every other uh, individual or group in classifying and segmenting data and in hypothesis formation this is how data mining is performed this is uh, you know sort of architecture these are databases and data warehouses data metadata you have data mining applications four of four types i just showed you then data mining results and this is front end and these are the data mining queries being sent by the user these are data mining applications and these are the database queries so try to understand that this is not actually taking out of data just like something is stored in database you are picking out no this is actually inferring new information on finding the patterns there are various related fields you will be coming across uh, data mining machine learning is one of them visualization databases and statistics they work in tandem in close coordination and this is data mining and knowledge discovery kdd this is data mining process revisited again now this is data warehouse you have selection and cleaning then the transformation then data mining actual actually done here the interpretation and evaluation finding the patterns and the rules and this is the knowledge and this is the understanding of us the user uh, there are various major uh, data mining tasks like classification like uh, predicting predicting and item class then association like a and b and c they occur frequently for example visualization to facilitate human discovery estimation you know, predicting certain value and deviation detection like finding changes and link analysis like finding relationship so these are all the all tasks which are involved in data mining what are the uses of data mining you know, in other sciences of computer science or other fields of uh, various fields sub fields like ai artificial intelligence and machine learning Uh, that involve combinatorial uh, or game data mining good for analyzing winning strategies to games and thus developing intelligent ai operators that is for example chess then we have business strategies we can involve data mining like market uh, basket analysis identifying customer demographic preferences and purchasing patterns A risk analysis like product defect uh, analysis means analyzing product defect rates for a given plant and predict possible complications uh, down the line uh, for example also user behavior validation like fraud detection so in the realm of uh, cell phones uh, comparing phone activity to calling records this can help detect calls made on cloned phones also credit cards comparing purchases with historical purchases so in this way we can detect activity with stolen cards the health and science is like protein folding a uh, predicting protein interaction functionality with biological cells application of this research include determining causes and possible cures of alzheimer's parkinson's and some cancers caused by protein based foods also going to extraterrestrial intelligence so like scanning satellite receptions for possible transmission from other planets these are the sources of data for data mining first of all databases most obvious the text documents computer simulation and now social networks what are the advantages of data mining various you know advantages we just saw in detail 
but let me point it point wise um, you know explain it to you marketing retail finance bank banking manufacturing and government but there are certain challenges of also as far as data mining is concerned like scalability dimensionality complex and heterogeneous data then data quality is also a concern data ownership and distribution privacy reservation uh, preservation streaming data uh, you might have seen it in my uh, data warehousing explanation all these are uh, certain challenges so in conclusion comprehensive data warehouses that integrate operational data with customer supplier and market information have resulted in explosion of information so competition requires timely and sophisticated analysis on an integrated view of the data however there is a growing gap between more powerful storage and retrieval systems and the user's ability to effectively analyze and act on the information they contain and data mining is going to give you a solution for this thank you so much take care of yourself